Hello everyone, my name is Rick Arter and today I'd like to show you guys another how-to video. Today I'd like to show you how to remove a 3-pin connector from a fan. The materials that you're going to need to do this are a 3-pin connector remover, the fan, a piece of paper, a pen, and tape. Now there's two different types of fans that will have um, there's uh, this is an Antec Tricool that I'm using for this demonstration and these fans have the silver wiring here which looks nice but it can make it a little difficult when removing the connector on regular fans you have your colors which you can just basically as I did in the, on this piece of paper here make a little diagram with your black red and yellow wires and then uh, do it according to the way the connector is but with these silver wires I found it a little more difficult so basically what I did was I made a little diagram according to the uh, the part that you remove here the little metal things that hold the pins in and then I took three small pieces of tape I numbered each of them one two three according to the way I made my diagram so that when I put it all back together I don't short anything out and it all works properly so once you got everything taped off here and you got everything labeled and you got your little diagram what you're going to do is take your tool and you're going to want to stick it inside these holes right here and when you look at it you'll be able to see where the pins stick up and you just stick it in there should be able to wiggle the wires loose sometimes it takes a few tries before you can get it there you go as you can see you're left with three semi C shaped connectors here and whenever you install these back into there after you make sure that you line them all up basically this is what you'll be left with here remove it from your tool you'll be left with your bare connector here and what you want to do is uh, look at your diagram make sure that everything is lined up properly and then what you'll do is just basically um, stick these back in there one by one and once they're all in there kind of give it a little tug make sure it's seated properly plug it in disconnected from the connector it's going to be plugged in before you power it on make sure everything's seated and snug and after it's uh, all connected turn your power supply on turn your computer on and you'll be set to go so hope you guys learned something and uh, there will be more how-to videos to come thanks for watching guys I'll talk to you later